do we have a special treat for you today. So let's just get right into it, but don't forget to watch till the end of this video because we're gonna let you know who wins our Steamboat Willie pin and we're gonna show you who the new pin giveaway is. Hi guys, bear with us, we got a new camera, but today we are taking you on a field trip. And not only are we going on a field trip, but we met some very special friends. It always feels like a little bit of Disney magic when we run into one of our followers. And even more magical at Pin HQ. Where's Pin HQ, you ask? Pin HQ is located in Central Florida, and it is just a few short miles from Disney World. And it is a must do if you're a pin lover. Now I know you're probably asking yourself, what in the world is Pin HQ? Well, we're about to show you, and you are in for a treat. Hello. How are you? So nice to see you. So guys, Pin HQ was founded by the Go Pin Pro team. They're the makers of the pin folios that we all know and love, and this is a pin lover's dream. And it is the premier place to buy, sell, and trade, and so much more. You guys have done a terrific job. It is so cool. And so what are the hours? Um, it's funny because we're trying to gauge it, but yeah, so we were doing October, 10 to 5. Okay. I think um, we're going to open later, like maybe 11. And then stay until 7 because a lot of people have been coming after work. Like some really great hours. And do you remember these beautiful boards that we saw when we came in? Did you know that you can rent those out to display your own collection? Let's learn more about that. How do you go about getting a uh, space? Seriously. Talk to any of us. Uh, so they're uh, fifty dollars a month plus for each pin. It's fifteen percent commission, and um, you pick out your board space, and all the so the subscription goes through Square, so it does it automatically monthly. And you can either ship your pins to us or just bring them in. Got it. Okay. So, oh, so you can be out of state yes, and put so it. Oh, so we have some people from the UK, no from way. California, and like Kansas, Oklahoma. That is so. That's so awesome. So where did you come up with the idea from? I think it was our dad that mentioned it. He's like, we should do something where other people can sell their pins and it gives us a way to give like have them be able to sell their pins they can come out and get more people in the store right. and it gives us more inventory a lot more variety as well because yeah. like the board behind you those are all like high-end well not all but high-end auctions older pins yeah there's some over there with profiles and then there's some people up here with just ten dollar pins yeah so it allows you to have a lot of variety and you're so these are all um, plastic molded so they're not gonna snap easily and <laughs> it's from it's super easy you just yeah. get your pin backs off get your pins off all that stuff it looks like yeah. a little mini crowbar <laughs> yeah yeah that's a great idea yeah because I, I think i finally broken all my nails yeah. off and i stopped oh, getting yeah. them done and if so many like we would all do you know it, it does hurt when you're yeah. pulling out backs so. yeah and it's like it's just pins why do my fingers hurt yeah, yeah. yeah it's a dec pin so it oh. is an actual pin they made a set with like all the characters oh made. it's really cool okay got you got you I love how they made it look like an actual name. Tag. It looks real. And so yeah. you look at it, it does look like it is like enamel. Yeah. yeah. It's so cool. It's amazing. Such a, such a great selection though. I mean, Saturday it had a line of like probably five wow. people. Wow. Are you waiting kidding? for the pin wheel and there's people at every single panel. It was so cool. You're going to have to have a queue out there like they have at the... <laughs> Just get like the Disney app. You already have a little rope. <laughs> I, that's Man. cute. That is so cute. And those chairs are awesome. And guys, what about this pin social hub? There's books underneath this desk area that you can just flip through and spend hours and hours. Guys, there are so many cases to look through. Just look at all these possibilities. And then they even have new pins. And then what about those pin folios? If you guys don't know what a pin folio is, they are these great stick and go pages for you to carry and protect your pins. Look at this one, this is my favorite. I'm definitely gonna have to add this for my collection. And up next, it is lovingly called Rainbow Road. Have a look. Now, since I'm a completist, I think one in every color is an absolute must for any pin collector. Go have a seat. Relax. There's some treats. There's some cookies here, too, for you guys. Help yourself. Huh. When did your daughters start doing this? When you started doing this with your daughters, how old were they? Oh, when they did, uh, they were, my son was 13, Sydney wow. was 11, and Julia was 8. And then I was homeschooled. I'm a teacher, and I homeschooled. And, um, you know, it was such a fantastic opportunity yeah. because we would have never been able to navigate this without being homeschooled. Oh, yeah, you know, yeah. exactly. They wouldn't have had the time. And so they, they learned so much about business and yeah. networking and 
Okay, so what we call this, this is our VIPP area, so it's the very important pin crews. Ah. And this is for everyone that owns a board. We, this is like their little VIP seating area. Ah. And so they come here, we have like candy, and they can hang out. And sometimes we do like our business meetings in here. So it's just a fun little area that we thought it would be nice to add. Tell me about the pinwheel. So the pinwheel is the largest pin display in the world. And it actually currently right now has over 6,000 pins on it. That's amazing. And there's room for more. <laughs> okay. So people come here and they look and they can buy or they can trade or they can do... That is so awesome. So the majority of them are eight dollar pins, and then we have it where you get, I think it's five or more, and then you get one free. Oh, okay. We like free. Yeah, free's we good. Free. Free's, free's good. good. <laughs> and so you just flip through, and these are two foot by two foot boards. Each one of these, and there's six on each panel, so we have lots of pins and lots of boards. Oh, they just slide out. These are your boards, right? These are the. Do you sell these big ones like this too? <laughs> we sell the two foot by two foot boards. Yes, they're called Pinsper. Oh, inspiration. So, you said how many pins are here? Six thousand. Oh my gosh, you got it. Oh, okay. <laughs> to the point where we finally figured out everything in the store because we, we've only been doing this for a month. Like we came up with the idea of owning wow. a store and we created this all within a month. So it's only been a month. And um, yeah, so we finally got to the point where everything's figured out in here. So do you pack orders here too? We do, yeah. Okay. It's originally supposed to just be headquarters where we were going to be doing shipping and things. Right. But then we came up with the idea of it would be more fun if we did a retail store. That's so cool. I, I love it. I love it. I want to just come and hang out. So what, what's next for you guys? What's What's next? Um... Did you catch that? If not, be sure to check in with Go Pin Pro for the latest. And thank you so much for watching. So guys, we had the best time hanging out with Go Pin Pro. And you really didn't think we were going to give away any secrets, did you? So if you want to keep appraised of what's new with Go Pin Pro, make sure that you follow them. I'm going to put the link in the bio. And definitely head over to Pin HQ because it is a mecca for pin lovers. And we hope to see you there. And let's get on to the next part of our video. Okay, guys. Now it's time to draw our winner for our Steamboat Mickey Steamboat Willie Fig Pin. I'm going to enter everybody's name into our random generator and we're going to draw a winner. So exciting. I pasted everybody's name into a document earlier and then I'm just going to go ahead and paste that all here and then I'll scroll through here so you can all see that your name is in here and I think we had 56 comments this week. So let's go ahead and pick our winner. Who's it going to be? Let's spin it and see who it is. Joker's girl. Woohoo! I just love that part of the video. And congratulations to our winner. Make sure that you reach out to us on Instagram and give us your address so we can get that pin on the way to you. And it is this great Steamboat Willie fig pin. And next Tuesday, we're going to be giving away this Orange Bird fig pin, which is a great pin too. I love fig pins. If you guys haven't started collecting these yet, you're missing out. And remember, all you have to do to enter is subscribe to this channel and comment on the newest video. This video right here. And then next Tuesday, we'll turn off commenting and we'll be loading in new video and we'll announce the winner and happy collecting.